Steeler, Steeler, are you all right? <sighs> Libertad. <clears throat> tree with a ding in it. Were you looking at that Libertad and run into the tree? <clears throat> The boobies, 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 the boobies. This is Summit Lake State Park. It is located near Newcastle, Indiana, in East Central Indiana. Summit Lake became Indiana's 19th state park in 1988. The park covers 2,680 acres, including an 800-acre lake. everyone, Silver Steeler here. And Winning Image Photography. Welcome to another state park video featuring precious metals. Today we find ourselves at Summit Lake State Park. It is near a town called Mount Summit. So I just thought this would be the perfect place to show off my silver Libertads. Because you know, uh, they pair up well. Uh, now they go hand in hand. Ow! Anyways, this is a man-made lake. The construction of a flood control structure at the headwaters of the Big Blue River that created Summit Lake began in the mid-1970s. When the gates of the dam closed in 1980, the man-made lake began to fill. In 1988, after several years of planning and construction, the Big Blue River Recreation Area was sold to the state of Indiana and became Summit Lake State Park. Let's take a look at my modern-day Silver Libertad collection. It all started in 2017 with the purchase of a silver starter pack at spot price. And this was one of the coins they gave me. So it started my Libertad collection by accident. I was rather late to the game. I knew of them. It was just something that I hadn't really dived into yet, probably due to going after all those ASEs. So then, it was three years later before I bought my next five Silver Libertads, and they were the 2020. And these ones were, uh, these ones were pricey at the time. The pandemic was happening. It was also one of the lowest vintage years. So I was very pleased to get some of these. So that brings my total up to six right now of the 22 ounces that I have. And this is the 2022 ounce version there's a long story behind this. If you want to see that video, link's at the top. We move on to the 2021 version. And I only have one of these. I think I was chasing after the two ounces, which you're about ready to see next. I only got one of these. And then the 2021 two ounce. Do you have one of these? Everyone out there knows I made huge two ounce fan of silver. Just love them and I think 2020 made me have to chase all the rest going forward so there's the 2021. That brings us to our present year of 2022. I decided up to buy one from the previous year and get two of these this time. Still chasing after the two ounces. And two ounces are pricey so Sort of just said, eh, just let's get two of these and keep it going. I think one of them I got off Silver Heist, I think. Next is the 2022 two ounce version, bringing my total up to three of the two ounce coins now. And the whole total stands at 15 ounces that you've seen so far. Love those two ounce versions. 
This next piece will bring our total up to 20 ounces. I had to go bigger. It's a five ounce 2021. Everyone knows bigger is better, right? Now you know why we don't have smaller denominations. Yeah, well, let's add some clarity to the subjects at hand with this two ounce version of the 2020. I had to get this one. I looked it up at, uh, at Max and it was going for $400. I managed to snag this one graded deep cam from bullion exchanges. This is my favorite piece. Running image photography and I always wanted a reverse proof. Those are so expensive that this one had to do for now. But it's my favorite of the collection. Let's go take a little tour of this place. And guess what? We managed to get a camera underwater. This brings up some interesting ideas for me in the future. Maybe I need to do a coin underwater video one time. You're not going to put your silver underwater. No, I'm going to keep it protected as well. Don't you worry. Now I'm worried. Well, that's going to bring this one to a close. Remember to like, subscribe. And all those other good things? We'll see you on the next video. Bye, everyone.